Hi YouTube. Hope everyone's doing good tonight. I um, I'm coming to you to show you how to um, if you want to take um, your powder with you but don't want the mess of the powder. Please excuse my mess. I barely have room here because we're trying to get the floor down. My husband is putting the floor down. So, you hear me moving silverware, or not silverware, but things around. I collect old things, so. And I tell my husband all the time, lucky for him, I do, or I'd get rid of him. <laughs> so, excuse them. I'm in the corner of the kitchen. I, oh no, I just made a mess. But that's what I'm talking about. So, anyway, let me um, get started. If um, this is if you want to take your powder with you, but you don't want the mess of the powder. So let me just put the camera down here where I can show you what I'm doing. Okay. Hang on. Bear with me so that I can move this sucker around. And you'll hear me say sucker a lot because that's what we say here in the south. <laughs> oh, there's the ceiling. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So, let me see. Right here. See, make sure that I'm... Oh, my. What are we doing here? Right here we are. Right here we are. So, on the counter. And I've got my powder. And you see that... Well, let me see if I can fix this to where I can... I have this on a tripod, but I... Didn't think this thing through, I don't think. Let me see here. I need two hands to do this with. So let me just... Please forgive me. You're seeing everything but what I want you to see. Hang on. I need to take this down a bit more. A bit more. It needs to come down. Okay... Okay, it's not going to work. So, let me see here. Make sure that I'm showing you what I want to show you. Alright, here's the powder. And I have an empty container. I hope you can tell what I'm doing here. I have an empty container. Oh, excuse the mirror. That I'm going to use. It's empty. It is, well, I'm not going to tell you what it is, but anyway, it is empty. And I cleaned it with alcohol. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take this powder. Hang on, let me see if I can put something to it. Well, I need to tighten this up. I hope that I'm not, that I'm getting this right. Hang on, kids. Let's see. Okay. I'm sorry. Maybe I can edit this out, but I doubt it because I haven't learned how to edit yet. Okay. I think we got this on the run. And I wanted something square. So I'm using a Fit Me um, foundation. Okay. And I have a square container, but you can use round. You can use whatever... Um, kind of container that you want and I have the isopropyl alcohol and you can use I have 50% here but you can use use as high as the up to um, up to 70% I would not use a hundred percent and I have a knife here that I'm going to use I was going to use a spoon but I'm going to use this knife and you need paper towel or tissue, which I have. I have my tissue right here. Okay, and what I want to do is, some people use as a bowl, but I'm going to use my container because I'm not going to waste. And this is a cheap powder that I have that I wanted to show you with, which I would use this with an expensive powder. You can use any kind of powder you want. Now, I know you say, well, I can use my... Um, I can take a, a pressed powder with me. Well, that's, yeah, you can. But this, I'm just showing you, if you have like a banana powder or Laura Mercier, and maybe she doesn't have a pressed powder. 
you can take this, and I'm not going to squirt this. I'm going to open it up, and I'm going to just drip as much of this in as I can. So I just start dripping it in here, and maybe I will spray it. My hands are clean. Always make sure anything that you use, your utensils are clean. I'm going to... I don't want to spray because then this powder is going to go everywhere. And I do have droppers, and that's what I should have used. I buy droppers. When I go to my sister's, put a little bit of this in here, and then use the knife to stir it with. And this, you can do this if you travel. If, if you travel a lot, like I do, because I, I start work on um, Sunday night. I leave home, and I don't come home until um, until Monday, or, Lord, I'm getting all, I can't do two things at one time. <laughs> yes, I can. But I leave on Sunday night, and I don't come home again until Friday night. And right now, I'm on my winter vacation. What I do, I have, I get a vacation. So... And um, so you just stir this up till you get it the consistency you want. And keep stirring until you get it kind of thick, but not... Because, see, I just made a mess all over the countertop. All over. Um, just keep adding. And if, if you can always add more alcohol. Now, like I said, I wouldn't use 100% alcohol. That's just too much. Um, percentage to put and I did I see I did get a little bit of too much here so let me put a little I got a little too much powder so let me put a little more alcohol well there's no more in the in the sprayer so let me well let me use my spray. Woo! Yep, I got alcohol now. Let me put a little tiny bit. I like the sprayer because you can control it more and just get a spray of your what you want. But anyway, this is what you do. You, you um, stir it up and then to uh, you just smooth it out as best you can. Now, I didn't put it all the way to the top. I should have, but I didn't. And you can. You can put it all the way to the top if you want. And what you do is you just um, wrap the Kleenex around. Let me move this now out of the way and put this over here. Around the the square and you just press till you soak up some of that alcohol just keep pressing press and it's better with a paper towel because a paper towel has a little bit of of um, of a texture to it and that is a little bit better so you just and it's a little thicker as well there goes the phone. My husband will get it. He's in the other room. Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> if they, it's important, they'll call back. Maybe he's not. But anyway, you keep pressing. I'm sorry about the phone. Sorry about that. Nothing I can do about it, though. But you just keep pressing, and I'm going to, yeah, he got it finally. And I'm going to just press it with my finger a little bit. But, yeah, you can just press. And then you want to let it dry with the lid open somewhere where it's not going to get contaminated. Um, if you don't want to leave the lid all the way open, then... Um, Close it down till at least a little air can get to it. 
but yeah that's what it looks like and then when it dries you can use your brush and when you travel it's not going to make a mess like I have right here see the mess I have so yeah if you like what you're seeing on my channel please subscribe and like and I'm gonna try to do a series which is gonna be every week three things that I would lose or use so stick around give me a thumbs up subscribe on that box down below if you haven't already and if you have I'm glad you did thank you and come along for my journey hope you're having a great journey bye